here at Dietering Orchards. We have apple days, which happens all throughout October. We have about 30 varieties. We have Cinderella pumpkins, we have white pumpkins, we have warty pumpkins. <laughs> we have regular orange pumpkins, so everything you'd want as far as squash and pumpkins for Halloween. We have tractor rides that are free for the kids. We have goats and chickens and cows, and we have an apple blaster, which is just loads of fun. It's like a big apple slingshot for the kids. We have a hay maze, which is great for the little kids. They can crawl around on the hay and get lost in the little tunnels in the hay. So super fun. It's free for the kids. We also have a free corn maze. Our apples are pretty good, fresh, just eating them fresh. But uh, we have a pie shop here. We have a gal that makes pies and apple pies are good. If people want to make pumpkin pies and stuff, we usually try to steer them toward the squash. That's commercially, that's what they use for pumpkin pies filling is squash. And they have a lot thicker meat and uh, you get more bang for your buck out of a squash than you will a pumpkin. Once you put the spices in, you can't tell the difference. Our popular, most popular squash is probably acorn squash and then delicatas and butternuts. We've got the maze, we've got cow train rides, we've got the rides down to the pumpkin patch. We have horse drawn and we have tractor drawn. Just a lot of activities, a lot of fresh produce, apple ciders, carameled apples. The Honeycrisp apples by far um, outstanding. Uh, the big Johnny Golds, at, uh, they eat great. And all of them are coming on really good. We're gonna have a great season in apples too. The corn gets up to 11 feet tall. And this is the corn for the maze. A lot of new attractions in the maze this year. Denise and Dana have put four new attractions in, along with all our older attractions, but a lot of really, really high-end new stuff going in there this year. So it's going to be excellent. 